Well, we are continuing our conversation with Eddie Nunez with Alliance Insurance Services. We are talking about insurance and natural disasters. Plus, we are still taking your questions. You can text your questions to the number at the bottom of your screen. So let's jump right back into it. What about flood water and cars? So if there's a roadblock sign and a driver decides to go around it and they get stuck, are they covered? Yeah, so flood insurance, that would be, if you have comprehensive coverage on your auto policy, flood is gonna be covered on your vehicle. You know, that's something that, you know, is completely out of your control. And that's for the most part what comprehensive is for, the okay. unexpected. Wanted, you also wanted to talk about the difference between um, cash value and then replacement value. Kind of talk about that. Yeah, that's very key to understand and, and to understand what you have listed on your policy. Um, they're very different as far as, you know, the compensation you can see in the event of a claim. Um, actual cash value does take into uh, consideration uh, depreciation, whereas replacement cost does not. So when you're calculating into depreciation, obviously the return that you would get on your item, be it your building or being your contents, would be significantly less um, as opposed to having it on replacement costs. Okay, and we are getting some questions in. The viewer is asking, what can I do to lower my car insurance? Everybody's looking for something, so yeah, obviously you, you want to ask uh, your agent uh, and your carrier what kind of discounts are available. Um, setting things up on automatic payment is always a discount that's available with most carriers, as is anything such as like paperless. Um, and then also you, you, there's tweaks that you can make. Deductible, does your deductible still align uh, with your needs at the moment? Um, mm -hmm. I have some people that are like, I wouldn't file such a small claim, so maybe I slightly adjust that deductible to better represent you know, my risk tolerance. Okay, and next question here, how does umbrella insurance work? So umbrella is excess liability coverage and it also helps um, cover some of the exposures that you, maybe your underlying policies wouldn't. So you know, um, umbrella would sit over top if we're looking at it from the personal sense, your home and your auto, mm -hmm. maybe if you have toys, boat, ATV, uh, they all have liability coverage attached to those policies. But say you have a significant loss and those underlying policies weren't enough to cover that loss, that's where your uh, liability uh, your excess umbrella liability coverage would kind of sit over top in the event that you know you have a very massive liability claim. And bringing back up the car conversation, if someone didn't have flood coverage, what um, about their cars? Are they are they going to be covered? Yeah, the vehicles would be covered in the event of a flood, okay. um, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, again, that would be uh, your comprehensive would respond to that. And I'm, I'm curious on my own, you know, what are some of the things that you see that people have a tough time with or navigating through that your office gets um, a lot when these disasters happen? Yeah, I think a lot of the time when these disasters happen, panic ensues, you got to remember to stay calm and just follow the process, be responsive, be attentive. You know, the quicker you are to respond, the quicker the claims process could kind of move forward. And also details and documentation, you know, are extremely important to help things resolve it in a timely manner, you know, get you back to where you were before. And some good resources, could you share that? Yeah, definitely make sure that you have your uh, agent number, you have the 1-800 number for the carrier in the event that, you know, it happens at an odd hour of the time, um, and your policy number policy number and ID cards. Okay, well remember if you missed any part of this conversation, you can find it all on our website in the two wants to know section.